Kylie Jenner claps back at haters and some of her family members. Kendall Jenner spotted out and about with another NBA star, plus Kim and Kanye are apparently getting on each other's nerves. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your Car Jenner Roundup. And before we begin today, make sure you hit the sub, like, and bell button, and follow me on social media at Allie Stagnita. Let's start off with Kendall Jenner because after she was spotted on a joyride with her ex Harry Styles, albeit in separate cars, she's now been seen out and about with another man, former NBA star Devin Booker. Oh, he's not a former NBA star. Yeah, he is. He's former? Well, he's still in it. He's still in he's it. In the NBA. Yeah, yeah, he is an MA still. <sighs> TMZ obtained footage of the two during a bathroom break near Arizona. According to the site, eyewitnesses say that the two certainly looked like a couple during their quick stop. However, sources close to both parties say the two are just friends, but I think it's important to point out that in LA, just friends is just as sacred as marriage in other parts of the country. Also in the past, let's recall that Kendall Jenner and Ben Simmons went on a double date with Devin Booker and Jordan Woods. Just putting that out there. On to Kim Kardashian now, because despite reports that Kanye was taking the kids to Wyoming to get them out of her hair, there's also reports that Kim wants Kanye out of her hair. Allie, did you get dressed up like that just to film? Are you gonna get changed after? Mm -hmm. See the things I do for you guys. Us Weekly reports Kim and Kanye have been arguing a lot in quarantine because she feels like he hasn't been taking care of the kids. The report also apparently claims that Kim believes Kanye is too focused on creating at the moment. So maybe this was the case and then he decided to take the kids to Wyoming. We need a better timeline. Allie, good news and any good news in Corona? Matt, when one was done filming, we can have conversations. <laughs> But alright, let's move on to Kylie Jenner because her name has been in the news a lot lately. After fans mocked her over her unflattering paparazzi pictures, they now claim that she has hired a photographer to take pictures of her out and about and then edit them. Adding to this, Kylie's now being slammed on Instagram for an apparent Photoshop fail. She's deleted the picture but posted a whole slew of bikini shots looking amazing. On top of this, Kylie did have some time to collab back at a commenter who said something about her hair. The person wrote, honey, you need some blending on that hair, and Kylie responded, I know, bitch, it's been a long day. I want that phrase on a t-shirt now. To more Kylie T now, in a Keeping Up preview, we see her family butting heads over Christmas Day plans. Talking about Christmas already? No, this was like pre-filmed. Pre Courtney's vocal about having, no, this was like back in like November. Courtney's vocal about having the family gathering at her house and Kylie is not for it at all. Instead, Kylie wants to spend Christmas morning at her house with Stormy, saying because it doesn't make sense, Santa only goes to Courtney's house. Chloe chimes in reminding Kylie that Stormy should be with her cousins during this time, but Kylie's not having it. Speaking of Stormy, some of our staff members do believe that she has indirectly caused the rift between AMC theaters and Universal Studios. I'm told we might be doing a deeper dive on this later this week, so stay tuned for the conspiracy theories. Hopefully I'm conveniently absent to spend time on literally anything else. But alright guys, that's it for today. Hit the sub, like, and bell button. Follow me on social media at Ali Stagnita. Bye guys. Hit sub, like, bell button. Follow me on social media at Ali Stagnita.